Island is a pretty haunted place. I think we can all agree on that. And I'm here with Justin Harden. He's the founder of Haunted Staten Island. He's going to take us through some of the more haunted places on the island and kind of tell us the backstory and uh, we'll see if we can see some ghosts. Oh, the, the story is the parsonage itself. Um, there's the, in the window, in the, uh, the attic, there's a light that has been going on and off. Um, years ago, there was a story that there was no electricity in the building and uh, at night you would see the, the lights going on. Um, then later you'd come back and the lights were off. I had actually had seen that years ago. I would drive past and you would notice the light was on and then you would drive past a little while later and it was, it was off. The church, which is very old, has, has many, uh, many stories. Um, ghosts and apparitions, um, walking around in the cemetery at night. Um, you could hear voices. Um, I, I know people that have actually said they've driven past and seen white mists moving around the, um, the tombstones. Uh, I, I've been there, and I've been in the cemetery, and um, when you walk around there, you, you get a feeling that you're being followed, and uh, you could hear actually steps in the leaves behind you, and um, you turn around, there's nobody there, or uh, you see shadows peeking behind trees, and um, there's just nobody there. There's just no explanation for some of these sightings. We're here at the conference house, and I'm already feeling some spooky vibes. I can see why people say this place is haunted. What are some of the things that you've seen here? i have walking into the actual park in the wooded area. Um, if you walk there at night, uh, sometimes you feel like there's people walking behind you. Um, you can see shadowy things in the, in the trees and everything. And uh, at one point, there's actually a well on the other side of the house. And uh, I was standing there and uh, as crazy as it sounds, I actually heard uh, somebody whispering my name from the woods over there, which actually kind of freaked me out a little bit. I, I, I've been on investigations. I, I've been to, to places. I've taken pictures. I, I've sat in the dark by myself for hours, um, waiting for something to happen. I mean, most times nothing happens. Sometimes you hear people walking or, or, or uh, I, I've heard children giggling. I think I've seen a ghost of a woman. Uh, I'm not about to tell people like I, I'm not going to force people to believe that they're ghosts just I can only go by my experiences and um, if I do happen to capture something on audio or video I could show them to them I could show it to them and um, let them make up their own minds about it I'm not gonna force the idea of, of there being ghosts on anybody I mean I it would be nice if we could prove that there's a uh, you know there's that there's spirits or ghosts or anything uh, it, this has been going on. People have been seeing this stuff for thousands of years. There has to be something to it. 